Alrighty. So, I can't believe I'm playing this game right now, because I haven't played it in a long time. But, we're playing Minecraft. <laughs> Alrighty, so I remember the last thing that I said was that I was going to build something. I can't remember if I said what I was going to build, but pretty sure uh, what I wanted to do was birch. Was a birch tree, because if you come over here into my tree chest, I've got a bunch of birch saplings, so I'm assuming that that's what it was. All right, but let me walk you guys through all of the new stuff that we've got here. I've done like a lot of things. And I actually attempted to record once, but it kind of, like, messed up because I didn't do something right. But nothing has changed in here, I promise. It's literally just the same thing. Um, yeah, this is, this is the same, I swear. That's pretty much the same. I didn't do, I, yeah, it's not pretty much the same. It's exactly the same. I didn't do anything. In here, though, I'm pretty sure it's different. Um, we've got some extra chests coming out of the roof or the ceiling or whatever. I just put droppers here and also I added a door here because one time I actually came back from like doing the AFK farm and I was missing my fishing pole which I didn't think was possible but apparently it is. So I'm assuming that something came up here and like hit me or something and then died for whatever reason. But yeah, I've got a bunch of stuff from this, so I've actually just, just been kind of trying to sort it out a lot, really. That's pretty much what I've done. But I've got a bunch of books, a bunch of, like, a bunch of stuff. I got a lot of saddles, too. Like, a crap ton of saddles. I got a double chest full of saddles on top of all of this. I know that I have got a mending book in here that I'm going to be using. And speaking of that, I need to show you guys what I have right now, and I didn't do anything special, I swear. All I did was get books from the AFK Fishing Farm, and I added them onto this stuff, but my diamond sword is, I don't remember what it was last time, but it's Unbreaking 2, Sharpness 3, Mending, and Looting 2. No idea what it was last time, but that's what it is now. I've got a bow here that is infinity mending unbreaking three power five flame and punch two i'm pretty sure i didn't have that last time and i i'm pretty sure not pretty sure i'm like 100 percent sure that i cheated on this because i'm pretty sure that you can't have infinity and mending at the same time so i kind of just gave it to myself in a way and so what i was just kind of planning on doing was uh i was gonna like hinder myself in something else so that I wouldn't feel as bad. So I was thinking about just getting rid of all the curses of vanishing and stuff, which isn't really that big of a deal because I wasn't going to use them anyway. But yeah, I, I, I had them I had them able to combine, I just couldn't like actually combine them. So I'm sorry that I cheated. And yeah, I've got this fishing rod, Luck of the C3, and Breaking 3, Lure 3, and Mending. Um, I had this exact same fishing rod, fishing pole, whatever, and that's the one that I lost, so I had to get it again, which was frustrating. But now on my armor, I have, I still have the thorns. All of them have protection three, I'm pretty sure. This one has feather falling four, ooh. But this one has mending on top of protection three, and the mending that I have here is going to be added to one of these. I was thinking about doing it to my boots since it has feather falling. So I'm actually just gonna go ahead and do that now. What else is on here? Power three, protection three, so that'll bump it up to protection four. Or well, maybe I should do it on my chest plate since it's gonna be moved up to protection four. That's probably what I should do. I'm not gonna be building that birch thing that I mentioned earlier. I know that I said that that's what I was going to do in the last episode, but since I haven't played in that long, I'm just gonna kind of walk through everything that I've got that's different. I've got a bunch of these here. I, I don't know if I said this last time, but I've got just a bunch of books in here. Um, these are just the single ones that don't have multiple enchantments. The ones that have multiples are in here. And none of them have mending. They're all just, they're really good. They're just, I'm saving them for later, basically. Nine levels. 
No problem. And now I can just take you guys to my chests, I think. Um, I'm pretty sure that's all that I have that's different. Oh, no, it's not. So, I have this iron axe here. I didn't do a diamond axe because I didn't, um, I didn't really want it. I didn't want to use diamonds, and plus, the iron is good enough. But, um, I have this. It is unbreaking 3, efficiency 5, and mending. <laughs> And it really, it chops through trees, like, really, really fast. So, that's why I got it. But, for the chest, this is full of dark oak wood. And so is this one. And I am getting ready to put the floor down on this thing. And, yeah. Basically, all the chests over here haven't really changed. This is still cobble. This is, uh, this is the saddle one with all the name tags. This is trees, I'm pretty sure one of these is potions, and this is tools, I've still got my fortune 1 and fortune 2 and regular diamond pickaxe, this is um, ore, this is weapons, I think, oh I need that. I'm gonna use all of my, my stone axes before I start to use this one again, and this is all food. Alright, also nothing has changed over there either, I barely go over there anymore since I got the pumpkin built. <laughs> But, yeah, we're going to go over here to the um, the zombie XP farm. And I, I actually found out that with mending, it's actually really difficult to use mending on all of your stuff. You can't do it at the same time. It's kind of just a small chance. But I did find out that you can put something that you need to mend in your offhand. And it will like basically give it to you without you having to use it and I have a feeling that if I use this axe again it's just gonna literally break so I'm just gonna come in here and I'm gonna level it up about halfway and then I'm just gonna leave it alone alright that's honestly good enough I just wanted to see a little bit of a uh, little bit of level on the axe because it really worries me because I there's mending on it so I definitely don't want it to break but now I am going to come back up here hopefully break down these um, dark oak trees with my other axes and then we I'm, I'm gonna try and figure out what I'm gonna do next because it's definitely going to be quite the journey I actually am, I want to say over halfway done with the saplings for the dark oak trees, but I honestly, I honestly have no idea. I know that I need like nine stacks, and I have who knows how many. Alright, for comparison though, this is what the stone axe does, and then let's pull this out, and I'll show you guys, like, look. This is the stone axe, and then this is this axe. Like, what the hell? It's like a drastic difference, and I love it. It's literally the best axe that I've ever used, and honestly I don't think having diamond instead of iron would make like a huge difference, so I'm happy that it's iron. And it's unbreaking, like, what, three? Alright, but I'm just going to finish off these trees, or well, f finish off the axes, more like, but then we're going to see, I'm going to take a look at all the enchanting books that I have, because I, I bet that I have some pretty good stuff, like, waiting for me to just use, so we're going to go take a look after I have these trees done. Also, one thing that I do need to mention... I've just literally just sat here and like not talked forever, but one thing that I do need to say is that I literally don't know how this microphone audio is going to sound like on here, and I know that the camera is like kind of not facing me, but I have it on my extra monitor over here, but um, I do have another microphone coming in, like an actual microphone, and the reason that it has really kind of taken so long for me to record another video is because of a microphone issue. And I just kind of gave up today and just decided to use this one. So 
Sorry if it sounds kind of garbage, but it will get better literally in the next video because I'm sure that I'm gonna stop after this and like probably do like some stuff off camera. I'm gonna like try and make myself like not do big stuff off camera anymore because I know if somebody is like literally watching the this like from episode one all the way to now they're probably like okay he literally does everything off camera you know whatever but I'm, I'm really like I'm gonna try and stop myself <laughs> I'm just gonna start doing the trees off camera now because now that I have this I mean it really it really does like make it so much easier and I've also almost got I showed you guys this earlier I've almost got this chest full with dark oak and then once I, once I get this filled up, I have a feeling that literally, maybe even in this episode, we can just put the floor down in in the house, which would be a pretty pretty big step forward for the house because honestly, I have literally nothing done. But I can also show you guys wh how many saplings I've got. Uh, wrong chests. Let's see, one, two, three. I have six stacks. So that's, yeah, six stacks and then 25 and that's 29 and these could drop some more. So I've got six and a half stacks basically and I know that I need nine so I've only got just a few to go. Alrighty, I'm pretty sure that tree only dropped like three saplings so I'm kind of annoyed with it but we're going to go ahead and head on over here, like I said, and we're going to grab all of the books out of the fishing farm first and then we're just going to head on over to the enchanting room. So I'll be alright back. Alright, so now we can just look at all of the enchantment books that I've got here. Um, first things first though, I want to decide like what I want or what I see here. I should definitely make some knockbacks. I've got a knockback 2 book now, another knockback 2, and I just broke my freaking thing. <laughs> okay, so now I, I need iron. Right, and then there's the anvil again, and now I will make a knockback three book. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, so I'm assuming that knockback two is as far as it goes. So, I have this knockback two, looting two, mending, sharpness three, and breaking two. Okay, that sounds good enough for me, and I'll put the knockback away for good. Alright, we're gonna test some of these out first. Sweeping as is apparently something that I can add to this. I'm not entirely sure what the hell it's gonna do. I have a feeling that I just need to get everything that's for this. So I'm going to keep all of that stuff for it. And we're just gonna kind of add everything to it eventually. That's gonna take some time though. <laughs> Definitely some time. I'm gonna go ahead and check and see what the lowest one is though. Right now I have 15 levels. So which one is this? This one is the fire aspect too. It's gonna cost 19, so I've only got four levels to go. So I'm gonna go ahead and add these together and make a protection four. I'm gonna add these together and also make a protection four. And then I'm just gonna put everything back on. Alright, so I'm gonna go get some levels, and then we'll be back. Alrighty, so I've kind of edited a little bit of the recording quality and everything of this, so, because <laughs> I haven't recorded in a long time, so I was, I, I think I had it lower than what I should. So it should be bumped up a little bit, the audio should be fixed a little bit, because I did check the previous uh, recordings, but right now I have 19 levels and I am going to go add one of these books to my sword and then I'm just going to go back into the AFK fishing farm and just kind of do this until I get, you know, enough to put all of these on here. So I'm pretty sure that one is the one that I want at first so now that we have this on here let's see yeah it's gonna start costing a whole bunch yes it's gonna cost a lot of freaking levels to add stuff to this now but honestly I think it'll be worth it because since I do have the fishing farm 
um, and all of my stuff, all of my stuff with mending is actually, you know, good to go. Speaking of which, I actually got another mending book while I was doing the farm, so let's go grab that. Alright, so before I go put this mending on here, I'm going to get enough levels for it, so I'm going to go see how much it's going to cost, and then I'm going to do some more AFK fishing, and then I'm going to just stay busy while it does that, and then I am going to be putting the floor down in the house, and that's probably just going to be the most important thing that we do in this episode, since it is kind of like a comeback episode. So, let's go ahead and see how much that costs, and then I'm going to AFK fish while also doing other things. Alright, it's only going to cost 10, which honestly is a lot less than I expected after I just saw 38 levels for one of those books. So, I'm satisfied. 10 levels shouldn't take that long, and I'm just going to edit the video that I just recorded, so yeah, it's a win-win deal. I get to kind of finish this off pretty fast, and I'll probably also take a look at this audio and the video quality on this one and probably edit it, tweak it a little bit more. I'm trying to get this, like, kind of perfect, you know? You know what I mean? And I know it's probably going to take some time, so please bear with me. And... But yeah, yeah, thank you guys for watching though, thank you, because really, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Alright, but I'll be back. Alrighty, so right now I've got 10 levels, and I'm going to go ahead and get this mending onto the boots real quick, and also I did get another mending book while I was doing that, I got a mending and an efficiency one. And honestly, I might just save that for uh, one of the pickaxes because, you know, efficiency, hello. So I'm probably just going to save that one, but with this one, I am just going to put it on my boots. Let's get rid of that, though. So let's go ahead and put it on there. And now I've only got that that doesn't have mending on it. And we are going to go head back to the AFK fishing farm where I'm going to do something really quick. Alright, so I was going to do this off camera, but then I realized um, I do way too much of that. But I have made six hoppers and 12 chests, so six double chests basically. And in order for me to keep doing the AFK fishing farm for like a long time, I'm going to need to add a lot more of these. Not really a lot more, but plenty more, basically. Alright, now I've got this all the way down here. And honestly, I could just finish um, putting it to the bottom. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and build some more of those and just take it all the way to the ground floor. Because honestly, that seems like the easiest thing to do. I just, I don't want it hanging like in the middle. And yeah, so we're just gonna do that. So I need four hoppers and then eight extra chests. And now we are gonna go place these in here. And then I'm gonna AFK, f and then I'm gonna go fishing for a while now. I used to only have like four chests, now I have like 20. Let's see, how many chests are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen chests now that can get filled up. It's great. I love it. Okay, well, I'm just gonna go ahead and start my little AFK fishing farm process, and then we are probably going to put the floor on here the next time that I am done. And I don't know how long it's going to take to fill these chests up, but I hope it doesn't take that long. I mean, I hope it does take that long. I hope it takes a long time, because I don't want to sort through all of it. <laughs> Alrighty, so I am kind of done in this episode with um, the AFK Fishing Farm. As you can see, I have 29 levels, and I gotta turn the sound on. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> 
Alrighty, so now <clears throat> what I'm gonna do is I'm going to tear down these trees and I'm gonna put the floor in on in my house. Finally, I'm gonna leave all of the bottoms of the trees on here though. And I should probably use my stone pickaxe. That's gonna take forever though. But I will let you guys know whenever I've got these trees taken all the way down. Alrighty, so now that I've got all of these torn down and their saplings and leaves have come out, now I can take all of this wood and I can finally place it down. So here we freaking go. I would be really irritated if I didn't have enough, but I'm pretty sure I do. I have like way too much to not have enough. Alrighty, I am almost done with this entire thing. All I have to do now is just finish a couple more lines here. And right now I'm actually just gonna take all the torches off because they are actually kind of getting annoying and in the way. So, but yeah, I'm almost, I'm almost done. Alrighty, the floor is finally freaking done. And now I just have to set these torches back down. But holy crap, it's freaking done. I can't believe this, dude. Like, it's taken me, I don't even remember whenever I started this series, but it's taken since then to finish this floor. I am so bad at the game. <laughs> but now all I have to do is get those saplings in here, you know? And that's going to be a lot easier said than done, because that is going to take some freaking time. Alright, well, that is going to be the end of this episode. And in the next one, hopefully we can get the saplings put down. Um, like I said, I do have, what is this, six full stacks. And then I've almost got a seventh in here now. Yeah, I've got 44 here, so almost seven stacks. And then after that, we will place them all down and we will have our house finally done. But I will see you guys whenever that one happens. And I don't know when that's gonna be, but <laughs> it'll happen eventually. <laughs> so goodbye, have a great day.